she admitted to making the bobs and that she had used them to hurt a lot of people. A Hillsborough County woman is behind bars right now. Deputies tell us she made pipe bombs and planned to use them to hurt people. Good evening, I'm Keith Kate. And I'm Stacy Scheibel. Thank you for joining us. We have live team coverage on this disturbing arrest. News Channel 8's Masa Saidi is looking into the suspect and her past. But we begin with News Channel 8's Ryan Hughes. He is in Waimama tonight, live outside that woman's home. Ryan. And good evening. The woman had a cache of bombs and weapons inside her bedroom in that home. When her parents got suspicious, they made a call that put their daughter in jail. Ma'am, could we ask you just a few questions about your daughter? The parents of 27-year-old Michelle Colts got out of their SUV and went directly into their home, avoiding reporters. Less than 24 hours ago, they made the gut-wrenching decision to call the Hillsborough County Sheriff's Office on their own daughter. Her parents did exactly what we asked people to do. If you see something suspicious, please say something. What those parents saw inside Colt's bedroom was this. Two dozen pipe bombs ready to use, BB-style guns, numerous knives, books about mass shootings, and how-to manuals on bomb making. The amount of highly destructive materials we found in this home were astonishing. A neighbor shot this cell phone video that shows the significant law enforcement presence, including a bomb disposal unit in the Waimama subdivision on Jagged Cloud Drive last night. Those who live here were shocked by the arrest. Obviously don't expect it to happen in this area. The sheriff said the bombs were ready to use. They would have taken around 60 seconds to load with powder, and then they could have gone off. Colt's plans on where and when to use the bombs weren't revealed. And the woman remains in jail tonight in Hillsborough County. Her bond set at $180,000. We're live tonight in Waimama, Hillsborough County. I'm Ryan Hughes, aid on your side.